Hey everyone and welcome back. So today we are going to be making our own Lego street signs. Now if you guys are just starting off your Lego city or have been needing Lego street signs, this may be a very helpful video to you. So we are just going to show kind of me building this if you guys like this design of it, this is a welcome sign and I made these lights pop out so if you guys like this design I will be showing parts needed and just a quick speed build uh, it's going to be very quick and short but you guys don't have to build welcome signs I can show you guys right here this is another street sign there's many street signs out there but this is a quick build these are just neat the parts needed you will need your pole right here and you just have three pieces and you put this one by one stud on top and one by one stud on the bottom and you raise up the pole that way and you have a two scale Lego pole it's kind of hard to balance on there without a base plate but you can have multiple along the streets they're very these are very effective and you guys can probably make them right now all you need is some paper you you can draw this out if you don't have a printer but you guys can get some ideas like this it says Dallin's way and I used my name and that's kind of how I showed my personality so we're just gonna be using this as an example of making a Lego street sign because these right here are very easy to make extremely easy all you need is your glue stick and you kind of glue on the pole like that and the other side and you just stick the pieces of paper once they're cut out onto there and you just do the same for the top and boom and it's very easy to take off if you don't like it uh, it's easy to fix if you mess up and it's not too frustrating but yeah so we're just going to do uh, parts needed I'm going to show you guys here in a bit and then we're going to do a quick speed build and head downstairs showing me in the process of building this very unique welcome sign that I have made for my city. So we are here downstairs, and as you can see, I got this up here, and in order to do that, you just type in street signs in Google, and I went to this web website right here, and I just typed in what I wanted, just like so, and I put in my population and when it was established, etc. Now. For you guys, yeah, when you find a website that you can customize your street signs, all you have to do is take a screenshot. And for Windows 10, to take a screenshot, it is Windows Shift S. So for me, I'm on a Mac. Uh, so it would be shift command 4 and then you just get a capture of your custom street sign and you took a picture of it and then you go here and you go uh, insert upload well you go insert image and you upload from computer let's do that a little more clearly so see uh, right here 
it says upload from computer we're gonna click that and then uh, you simply go to and get the one you got so here's the one and you press choose and then uh, you have it right here so now the next step after you do all that it's very easy you just size it down this is not it, it even though it's simple you have to get it the correct size and I'm assuming it's about that big maybe so you size it down to something about that and we're just gonna print it out until we get the perfect size now if you guys don't have like the sign you're not making the sign I have like the uh, little build you can use posts instead you probably don't have to worry too much about how um, if it's like too small I mean too big because you probably want it a little bit bigger but if but if it's too small it won't look that good so I think this right here is about the size so we're gonna go ahead and print it out and and we're gonna head back upstairs to cut it and then we we should be done so if I don't get this first try I will keep resizing it and I'm not gonna show myself doing that because it may this video may end up being like 30 minutes long if we do something like that so it's not it's pretty simple to get on I mean, it's, this is just the really hard part is getting it the right size now if you don't have a printer you can always draw it out you can make it real big for you, yourself to draw it out the way you like it and and that's pretty much it so I'm gonna go ahead and print it out and we're gonna head back upstairs to cut so we are back upstairs and we're just gonna simply cut this out and see how well I'm just gonna kind of go around it so I don't have as much paper bothering me you can always draw this out and we're just gonna ever so slightly go around here the hardest part are those corners my face is like in the camera because I have to watch this carefully I mean carefully cut this so my voice may be louder than usual now this is not gonna be perfect I can tell you that Okay, touch-ups, there we go, so we kind of cut it out evenly, I need to get even closer, okay, so we are on the last and final step, so this part is fairly easy. All you need to do is get your glue stick and simply put glue on the back of this piece of paper and you probably don't need to get the center but I'm going to do it anyway because this sign is going to be on there for a while and see there we go get to the center and now all we do is place our sign onto our little build right here and kind of pat it down a little bit make sure it's all on and there you go.
sure it's center. And then you have your own Lego street sign. And to do this with these signs, you simply do the same thing. You use your glue stick, except you uh, put it on the pole first. Put the pole with some glue. And then you stick on the signs, and they just kind of hang there. Like, like that. So, that is it for today. If you guys like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And uh, subscribe to my channel for some more upcoming cool stuff. Uh, which will be here shortly. So, I hope you guys are well and stay safe. See you guys all later. Bye.